Hi guys, it's Eva. I'm here to do a quick review and a manicure using the uh, chalkboard nail art from Revlon. As you guys are aware, these are being sold at some of the Dollar Tree stores. And if you find them, I suggest you grab them. They are um, retail at I think like $10, but this is probably some of the old lines. So instead of having it discontinued, they sent some of these over to uh, DT. Um, I went ahead and grabbed this color only because green is my favorite color and I wanted to try it out. Um, I've already painted my nails. I did my ring finger with the black and then the rest is with the green. And um, we're going to be using three different types of stamping plates. The first one is from Muyu London. It's the Pro Collection. 04 which is um, this plate right here and I'm gonna use this image the theme by the way is a love letter so I'm gonna use that and then I've also got one from Estonia plate W104 this right here and then the last plate is from bundle monster it's the holiday collection number 16 and we're going to use this image right here. I've already done um, my right hand, so I'm going to show you guys um, how it looks using the left hand, okay? So let's get started. We're going to use Mundo de Uñas for the black. This is uh, number two. And I'm going to be um, using my Creative Shop Stamper. And my scraper, let me just grab it real quick. You can use anything you got, whatever um, whatever you like, basically. And I've got my um, cotton ball and the cotton claw already on the side. And I've also got um, the lint roller to clean off the stamper with. There we go. Since you have some of the polish left on the scraper, I'm going to try to use it on another nail. So that's that. We're going to grab some more polish. Do the ring finger next. Not the ring finger, you know what I mean. Pointer finger. Let's do this thumb real quick. So we're done with that. Now let's try to stamp. Let me get this dirty. We're going to try to stamp with Conad. I don't know the exact color of this, but um, <laughs> it actually matches this so it goes perfect together. I'm going to use this to stamp the ring finger. Which 
trying to line it up so it's perfect. So you lose that, and then we're gonna... all right. I'm gonna try to put this last image on, and then we'll be all set. Here is what it looks like I'm going to clean up. Well, actually, there's not much to clean up. What I'm going to do is, since I stamped over this, I'm going to put the um, matte top coat on from Essie. It's called Matte About You. It's kind of cute name, isn't it? And I'll be right back. Alright, guys, I'm back. I went ahead and put the top coat on and it actually it ruined the image a little bit over here I think because I had not used that top coat in such a long time I should have um, shaken it up a little bit beforehand but um, this is the finished look as far as the um, Revlon polish this is a great deal like I said, um, I would definitely repurchase this, and um, it applies on smoothly. The um, the brush on this side is like an oversized brush, which looks like this. I'm not sure if you can see that. But then on the other side, it's a little bit thinner. And they made it that way for a reason. And you could kind of use this as a nail art, but as you can see, it's a little bit thinner. It applied okay. Um, not bad at all. That's a dollar, right? Um, and I love the color, so I would definitely repurchase this. And thank you guys so much for watching. Take care. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share. Ciao.